Hello, I'm Dr. Hannah Jordan. I work for the New York City Department of Health and Mental Hygiene's World Trade Center Health Registry. At the registry, we follow the health of over 71,000 people who were directly exposed to the September 11, 2001 World Trade Center disaster and its aftermath. The registry includes rescue recovery workers, people who lived or worked in Lower Manhattan at the time of 9-11, and people who were passing by or commuting through the area on 9-11. Here at the registry, we conduct surveys and other types of studies to identify health problems that may have been caused or made worse by exposure to the September 11th disaster. Several previous registry studies have suggested that there may be a relationship between 9-11 related exposures and heart disease or stroke. This makes sense because exposure to air pollution has been linked to heart disease and stroke, and many 9-11 survivors inhaled air that was heavily contaminated by dust and smoke from the disaster and cleanup. Other researchers have shown that having post-traumatic stress disorder, or PTSD, may increase one's risk of cardiovascular disease. Because many people who were exposed to the 9-11 disaster went on to develop PTSD, it is possible that those same people may have an increased risk of heart disease or stroke. For these reasons, and because heart disease and stroke are leading causes of death in the United States, we looked at hospitalizations for heart disease or stroke among our enrollees. We focused on hospitalizations occurring in 2003 through 2010 among registry enrollees living in New York State because the state makes this information available to us and most of our enrollees live in this area. We found that 9-11 related post-traumatic stress disorder did increase the risk of hospitalization for heart disease and stroke. We also found that people who performed intensive rescue and recovery related work, such as working on the dust and debris pile on 9-11, had an increased risk of hospitalization for heart disease. If you perform this type of rescue or recovery work or develop post-traumatic stress disorder, we recommend that you discuss our study with your doctor. You can also tell others about this study so that they can be in touch with their doctors if needed. We will continue studying heart disease and stroke among registry enrollees. If you have questions, please contact us.